Why is that funny? He doesn't eat anything white. I don't like mayo, ranch, sour cream, no. Why? Cream cheese. Can you explain why? Because I don't like ranch, sour cream, mayo, and cream cheese, and they just happen to be white. I don't know. Are you guys trying to cancel feels, me on my own racist. show? <laughs> and you're, own white. you're white, and that feels racist. You're trying to cancel me on my own Rolling audio. Rolling audio. Rolling. We are rolling. Unique New York. That's good. Warm them up. Welcome to Good Company. In a world where one man... Uh, yeah, 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 that's yeah. not bad. Keep going. Give good. us a real one, then. Where one man what? <coughs> Give us a real more. intro, dude. You want a good intro? Yeah, get, just like that, though. Maybe All Dan right. does the intro for... Like I'm a summer blockbuster. If it's good right now. percent facts. Brought to you live by Jim McD and Silent Mike. Featuring... Fat Dan, oh. a.k.a. Dan Stornaiolo. <laughs> a.k.a. Dan Stornaiolo. They call him the arm, the handsome, Kyle Castro. They call him the third arm. Why the third arm? I feel like Steven Seagal's about to come creeping out of this corner now. <laughs> A little action film. Yeah. It's pretty good. It's good stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Topic Thunder. We are the uh, boys. D- Dean's not here, so I didn't want to like throw the gossip. Th- yeah, because we got Dan, and he's n- obviously not that into it because he's on his phone. <laughs> he's not that, that stoked to uh, be here with us, which hurts. You're one letter away from Dean. Just heads up. That's true. You're that Dean was, without the E, bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we don't even watch you here. We couldn't yeah, yeah. get Dean, but we got close. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just in terms of the spelling, not in any other way. But do me a favor, give this thing a thumbs up, subscribe. Two new episodes a week. Check out Fifty Percent Facts if you want a longer podcast Wednesdays and these audio versions also weekly. I'm here with Dan Storniolo, owner of CPG and longtime friend, the Arm, I guess. Kyle. I have a new name every, every Kevlar week. Kyle. Yeah, yeah. And the legend Jim McD, Kevlar 3SB.co. Uh, and I'm Silent Mike, your host. Greetings. There's a couple things. I forgot who I was talking to, and this happens to me a lot. I have a lot of conversations with a lot of different people, as, as we all do now that we own this brick and mortar, and things get bashed around. And someone told me, yeah, I think it was you, that you don't like peanut butter. Are you? Who doesn't like peanut butter cookies? Oh, me. That's no, an issue. Would, are you kidding that's me? An, Look at me. I don't like how rich they that's are. That's an issue. But what's the... But I love peanut butter. I'll eat peanut butter by the spoon. That full. makes no sense. Yeah. <laughs> what? If you yeah. throw flour and sugar in there, you got a peanut no, butter it's cookie. It's just different. It's too uh, rich. I can't do it. I don't know. It's... It's too rich, one, because there's extra fat in there. There's so the peanut butter cookies peanut, from... I like the texture. Uh, I'm the a gen- texture eater. I'm a texture guy. Girl Scout cookies, the peanut butter guys? Oh, those are different. Those are Reese's Pieces, basically. They're unbelievable. Yeah. Tag along? Yeah, not yeah. that. Except for the names. I, if there's chocolate involved, I'm, I'm game. So if it's for strictly sure. like... Oh, okay, so what if it's like a... Uh, for instance, like Nutter Butters. You don't like Nutter Butters? I actually think Nutter Butters are overrated. Um... They're those are so better. Good. Those are better because there's actual. You could taste like the texture of the peanut butter. Dude, and that's I, not I used to do something so fat with nutter butters. Can I explain? That's why we're here. I would pour that. I mean, this is where I think Cookie Crisp kind of stole my idea. Oh, they yeah. for sure yeah, did. Yeah. Dude. The CEO yeah. was over your shoulder yeah. with the General Mills. Yeah. General yeah. Mills is, is dude, I was there doing, the money issues. I was doing that at like five years old. I was uh-huh. pouring cookies in a bowl. You're Soldier Boy. And then I was yeah. And then Tan I was, grabs chips ahoy and just that's exactly what I was doing. That's what I was doing. <laughs> cereal. Boy. And then he's like, milk, vanilla ice cream. He's like, vanilla. no, I didn't. Cereal. I, didn't, I, didn't, I never yeah. got that bad. I, I milk, eat it by the spoonful with milk. Okay. That's been around, I feel like. But what does that have to do with time. peanut butter and nutter butter? No, no, I did those with nutter butter. Oh, no, uh, so one, I don't think nutter butter is that good. Yeah. I did it with chips, chips Ahoy, especially, and nutter butters. Okay. Yeah. But there's an obsession with peanut butter across the, the world. There's very few people that like with, it or with dislike good it. reason. Yeah. The very few people that dislike it. Mm-hmm. Kyle's weird for not liking the cookies. No, I like the texture of peanut butter that oh. more than like a cookie. So you like cashew butter and shit? Uh yeah. Oh, I yeah, don't yeah. like that. Like Nutella and shit like that? No, I hate it. I don't like you Nutella. Hate I don't Nutella? like Nutella. I don't like Nutella. You guys give me issues for not liking peanut butter cookie. You don't like Nutella. The name of this show came about because of Nutella. Yeah, it did. Uh, you guys suck. I don't like Nutella. You're disgusting. But what about some Nutella on a peanut butter? Yeah, cookie? yeah, yeah. I like the texture. If you were to put peanut butter and smear it on a cookie, I'd like it. Oh, like a peanut butter, two chocolate chip cookies with peanut butter. In yeah, see, I would love. That. I'd be about that too. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Why are you blushing? <laughs> that doesn't like, make any oh. sense. Why does that make no sense? <laughs> when you're five, going, oh, cookie <laughs> milk. That that's made what, sense. That's what a know? tag along is, right? It's a wafer, a layer of peanut butter, and then it's dipped in chocolate. 
Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. Kind of Ta- good. Oh, that's a really lot of good. peanut butter is, in between, is, though. Then. Is Tagalong the one that has more than one name, depending upon where it's I think, made? I think over the last couple of years they switched all the names. Oh, maybe so. I don't know. Um, long story short, <laughs> why is protein considered a health food? Why, or sorry, why is peanut butter considered a health food? Why is peanut butter talked about as a protein in source? Uh, source. Yeah. When it's got like, I think for a tablespoon, it's got like twenty grams of fat or something, and like What's five that? grams of protein. Like that's uh, a fat source. Uh, it's it's. Because people like peanut butter and yeah. they don't want to give it up. <laughs> the self-justifying. Yeah, it's like, let's oh well, see. it's got you know, it's got uh, protein. That's why and I call like, these uh, energy drinks. Yeah, or uh, health drinks. Well, it, it, it definitely got more more fat than than yeah. Than it's got more carbs than you would want from a protein source. It's got more carbs than protein. I, it, it's a decent amount of protein for a tablespoon. But eight grams. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> no, that's pretty good. It's not shit. I it, well, not How a, much like, carbs it's not a fat? direct protein source. But when I think protein if you're source, you're bulking. When I think uh, what protein source, I think like Jim thinks. I would think ratio to calories and ratio to fat and carbs. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I, I wouldn't say it's like a like a full on protein source. No, no, no. But no, that's no, how people no. talk. Or a health food. Yeah, no, no, no. If you're in a cut, yeah, you're str- yeah. It's a well, health, healthy yeah, yeah. fats can go fuck themselves. I hate that word. <laughs> I hear it a lot. <laughs> it is the biggest word. So eight grams of protein, that's sixteen like grams, oxymoron. sixteen grams of fat. <laughs> healthy 16? fat. Well, healthy fat, is- sixteen grams of fat. Oh, yeah. How, see, guess how many carbs? Like twenty with six. eight. Six. Oh, oh, which six. is yeah, because it's mainly fat. I know, but it depends where you look to. You go to is like this some is, Skippy. Um, you go to some. Is it Skippy Jiffy? Skip Jif? Jif? Jif. One of those have like twenty. They just get a bunch of sugar. Oh, probably. Yeah, Jif. This is the health encyclopedia from University. Oh, wait, of I, have, I have a very serious question. Medical Center. I have yeah. a serious question. It's not serious, but continue. Um, crunchy or creamy? Uh, creamy, cr- crunchy, yeah. crunchy all day. I like both. It depends on the application. I like both. I, I'm a texture guy. If I'm in a sandwich, if, if I'm in a toasted peanut butter sandwich, I'm going crunchy. If Crunchy's I'm, good. Then if I'm dipping uh, apples in it, it's smooth. You used to do that too. I used to do. I used to do yeah. a peanut butter toasted sandwich. Yeah, so good. Yeah, but my mom would cut the crust off too. Yeah, what's up with that? Why don't people eat crust? Yeah, why? I don't know. D- I d- love the crust. She just would. I, don't know. I, I think that there's a really good chance that your mom sends you loaves of loaves of bread right now with the crust already cut off. <laughs> is, is that Danny true? is the baby? Yeah, I am the baby. No, uh, I, yeah, we did tons of peanut butter sandwiches, Same. and I love peanut butter Same. too. But I I don't, and I, I'm a texture guy too. Why do you think yeah. I love ice cream? Like yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll eat whatever. Oh, but that's right, he doesn't eat ranch or anything like that. Right? Yeah, but we're not no going nothing there. white. You want to talk about some weird <laughs> shit? We're not going there. <laughs> Why is that funny? He doesn't eat anything white. I don't like mayo, ranch, sour cream, no. Why? Cream cheese. Can you explain why? Because I don't like ranch, sour cream, mayo, and cream cheese, and they just happen to be white. I don't know. Are you guys trying to cancel feels, me on my own racist. show? <laughs> In your own white. You're white, and that feels racist. You're trying to cancel me on my own show? Yeah. No, I just don't like those things, and they happen to be white. <laughs> There's not a lot of things you don't like, but a lot of things I you don't like are things. white. I hate those things. <laughs> I, sp- speaking of healthy things and unhealthy things and, and the, the uh, things that people get hung up on, I saw a, f- a friend of mine, Facebook friend, real friend, um, talking about how he wanted to lose some weight and whatever, whatever. And somebody uh, that he knows jumps in and says, well, I lost 70 pounds whatever, and I did it by cutting out uh, uh, yeah, yeah. corn syrup. Yeah, such a tired enter, argument. And like, enter X, tired. whatever. Yeah. People just say it. Yeah. I just stopped drinking Coca Cola and I ended up a bodybuilder. Well, I oh, stopped really? sitting on stools. I lost fifty pounds. <laughs> now what? I stopped retaining stools and I lost fifty pounds. But that's another story. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, yeah. In a short period of time. Why do you keep looking over at me? High fructose. You're trying to get you involved. You're talking about weight. You're looking over. At me? You were saying because you switched. We already switched topics, but I was saying healthy fats in terms of dietary food, and yeah. you automatically went to healthy fat. <laughs> this is true. Healthy and fat. Is healthy what, and fat. As yeah. in like body weight? Maybe. <laughs> That's where he we're went. talking about peanut butter fat. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. He's so just I, I got his, that after no, like a couple good. minutes there. So unrelated, but uh, but related peanut butter cookies. Okay. Yeah, not a fan. So, <laughs> smear a pound of it on a cookie, I'll eat it. What yeah. if you crumple up some peanut butter cookies and some vanilla ice cream? Yeah, yeah. then everything's a green light then. Well, this is all? <laughs> Everything is all. There's no limits so then. So, simply, simply just a... I, like, I, it's not that I don't like them. I'm just like, I'd rather have a chocolate chip cookie. Oh, yeah, that's so if you, if I'm you not took, against... No, I'll eat a peanut butter cookie. Okay, no, yeah. That's don't get right. it Yeah, it's not my go-to either. Yeah, yeah, You yeah. know what my sad go-to is? And I don't know if it's sad, but I think controversial... Oatmeal chocolate chip. My well, mom makes a, my mom makes chip. a homemade oatmeal chocolate chip that will blow your tits. Don't put uh, raisins crispy in it. Crispy or soft? Uh, in between. 
Soft, I think. Soft I, is I like very soft. Good. It's the best. It depends if it's homemade or not. That reminds me of uh, Chips Ahoy Soft is better. Chewy. I don't like their chips. Yeah, you I don't suck. like any packaged cookies. The, they huh? taste like totally chemicals, except yeah. that they're wonderful because of the because of the, because of the chemicals. Yeah. <laughs> the texture. Uh, yeah. Well, and that comes from the chemicals. It's so good. I don't like yeah, any packaged cookies like that. You don't all, like any pack. Like you don't like Oreos. No, no. The most overrated no, snack of all shit. time. Oreos are pretty. The shit. The most overrated are you snack of all time. Me? Yeah, Oreos are pretty shit. I love Oreos. No, they're bad. Back to peanut butter cookies. There's not really that much peanut butter in a peanut butter cookie. Right. It's just there for flavor. It's right. just so bread. It's, it's it's everything else. That's thing it's one. Ha, but have you ever been like at a conference where they go, oh yeah, you know, here's your afternoon snack, and it's like all of these like Costco cookies yeah. and muffins and shit, and you decide that you're going to eat. One or two, or maybe more of the giant peanut butter cookies, and then you get like major indigestion, like hmm. heartburn, whatever. I Sometimes. will get heartburn from peanut butter cookies, and I don't know. Oh, why. really? You know what? Yeah. The most heartburn. calorie dense foods on the planet? Those Costco muffins. Dude, yeah, we were, they who are. Was, what, oh, what are they talking about? Those are the craters, but they're healthy because they're oat muffins, and then they're fucking those eighteen thousand calories. Those Costco muffins are the greatest. <laughs> they're in the health section. Yeah, dude. Did yeah. you hear what no, I no, just no. said? They're Poppy? literally like dripping. I yeah, I love that. Well, you can no, call, they're it, fantastic, <laughs> dude. The poppy seed muffins that they have there are to die for. You can call anything a brand muffin and say that it's. <laughs> To die for. People <laughs> say it's healthy, but it's not. Because yeah. you, you look at it and it's like... Food excites me. Okay. Yeah, I know. That's why I brought you on. 500 calories for, you know... I actually don't know how much you, it, how You many know calories. you'll pop on a, a drug test if you eat too many poppy seed muffins? Okay, they dude. Get off of Reddit. No, I'm serious. <laughs> no, it's true. They literally wouldn't let us eat those yeah, because true. of the, like, they would, uh, would uh, pop for opiates. Yeah, opiates NCAA yeah. tests, like, boy, if you had poppy seed muffin or a bagel. Dan's just slamming Costco's yeah. before the big game. <laughs> They're like, you got to yeah. stop. His mom yeah. brought him a bunch. And kind. Oh.